Hey everybody, Phil here. Kyle's dad, seventy-seven, and Kyle. K Dodge, twenty-seven. I'm Kyle. And we've got our corn snakes here tonight. This one is actually Carolyn's snake. He's trying to get away from me. This one is mine. Um. This is uh, a melanistic albino corn snake. His name is Brick. I don't know how old he is. We got him from uh, PetSmart. But he is definitely a boy. Got some nice yellows on top of him there. Um, eating pinkies. And this is Charlotte. And she's a little runt. But she's nine months old. Hatched in July. So I got her from a breeder. She's a little motley annery. Hep for a male and stripe, Molly stripe. Um, in a couple of years, I'm gonna try and breed these two guys, a guy and girl. Charlotte's the girl. I'll be 15 when I get to see it. And uh, we'll get hopefully some a males and some anries and hopefully a snow or two. The a male and the anry together. Gives you the snow, which is the mostly white corn snake with the pinks and yellows in it. I think the very best part about the snakes is that on their bellies, where it's more different than on their skin, is that it helps them not to produce friction. That's what I learned. Yep. And uh, I learned a lot about friction, friction from my grandfather. This one's a little Charlotte. She's a little zipper. She just wants to zip around and so quick. Brick's a little bit calmer. And the corn snakes are great, great little pets. They don't bite. This one headbutts me. Yeah. They give Kyle a little fake strikes. But uh, they're great snakes and they only get about maybe five feet long at the biggest and big around enough to eat two mice at a time when they're adults and uh, right now they're just on pinkies still. She's only about 9-10 grams and he's about 13 so he's a little, maybe an inch or two longer. But uh, that's our corn snakes. And uh, next video we'll show you the ball pythons. Oh, Later. Bye bye.